Hello. Today we'll be showing you how to replace the motherboard in a Dell 3180 Chromebook. First, you will need a few tools. An anti-static mat is recommended to prevent electrostatic discharge, which can damage electronic parts. A small, magnetic tip Phillips head screwdriver will be necessary for this replacement. A spudger will also be useful during this replacement. You can use either plastic or metal, whichever you prefer. You will need thermal paste for this replacement. If you have tweezers, you might also want to have them handy, as they might be good for handling small parts. The first step will be to remove the two bottom cover screw covers. Now, you will loosen the seven bottom cover screws. They will not come out completely. Next, you will carefully pry and remove the bottom cover. Now, you will disconnect the battery cable from the motherboard. Next, you will remove the three battery screws. Now, you will disconnect the keyboard cable from the motherboard. You can now remove the battery. Next, you will remove the two USB shield screws and then remove the USB shield. Now, you will remove the two LCD cable shield screws, and then remove the LCD cable shield. Next, you will disconnect the LCD cable from the motherboard. Now, you will remove the Wi-Fi cable shield screw, and then remove the Wi-Fi cable shield. Next, you will disconnect the Wi-Fi cables from the motherboard. Now, you will disconnect the audio board cable from the motherboard. Next, you will disconnect the speaker cable from the motherboard. Next, you will disconnect the touchpad cable from the motherboard. Now, you will disconnect the DC jack cable from the motherboard. Next, you will remove the six heat sink screws and then remove the heat sink. Now, you will remove the three motherboard screws. You can now remove the motherboard.
The first step in the installation of your replacement motherboard will be to set the motherboard into place and replace the three motherboard screws. Now, you will reconnect the touchpad cable to the motherboard. Next, you will reconnect the speaker cable to the motherboard. Now, you will reconnect the audio board cable to the motherboard. Next, you will reconnect the Wi-Fi cables to the motherboard. Now, you will replace the Wi-Fi cable shield and the Wi-Fi cable shield screw. Next, you will reconnect the LCD cable to the motherboard. Now, you will replace the LCD cable shield and the two LCD cable shield screws. Next, you will reconnect the DC jack cable to the motherboard. Now, you will replace the USB shield and the two USB shield screws. Next, you will apply thermal paste to the CPU on the motherboard. Now, you will set the heat sink into place and replace the six heat sink screws. Next, you will set the battery into place. Now, you will reconnect the keyboard cable to the motherboard. Be sure to run the battery cable underneath the keyboard cable first. Now, you will replace the three battery screws. Next, you will reconnect the battery cable to the motherboard. Next, you will snap the bottom cover back into place and tighten the seven bottom cover screws.
The final step will be to replace the two bottom cover screw covers. You have now successfully replaced the motherboard in your Dell Chromebook. Good job!